There's so many flowers I can't get them all, but uh, I'll try. Yeah, they look great. And that smell is just intense and just wonderful. Okay, let's get a shot of you squatting down by the bees. I'm gonna zoom in here. Hey guys, what you doing? Okay, what do you call this cactus? This is a flying saucer trichocerus hybrid. Extremely fragrant. Mm -hmm. It smells just unbelievable. You can see how beautiful it is, the way that it looks, but the smell. And the bees like it. Come here. Kitty, kitty. Come here, Pandora. Kitty, kitty, kitty. How's this for you? Is this good? Looks good from here. It's quite a bundle. This is a beautiful flying saucer and look who showed up. We have a green bee. Can't see him very well. It's covered with pollen now. You can barely tell what it is. It's a monster. That's right. Climb back up. Get started again. I'd like to see a clearer picture of you, but. That's one bee that loves flying saucer, that's for sure. Okay, we're gonna sneak in from the side and get some of this action. These flowers should just look giant on the screen now. Very pretty and smell great. Very active already. Lots and lots of bees. Okay, how about an overview from the side? Okay, She's on let's get a close-up of these hairs before the sun blasts us with blinding light. Change the angle. All right, here's where the action is. Or was. The 
Let's look down the tube. It's awful dark down there. Never zoomed in too far. Let's back it out. Yummy, yummy. Enjoy the flying saucer. That's a wrap for you. It's definitely a buzz over here. How about a wide shot of the flower? There's the whole thing. You can see the activity. Such a mesmerizing scene, I don't want to leave. I have too much footage for the video. It took me forever to edit. That's okay, let's go in close. Okay, this is a look-alike sneak peek. This planet appears to be a flying saucer at first glance. It's got the right color pattern, and uh, the stem looks almost exactly the same as a flying saucer, maybe a little skinnier. But it doesn't seem to have as many petals, and the quality of the coloring is different than the flying saucer, so it's, it's a look-alike. And the bees like this hybrid also. Let's go in close. Okay, here's one character that I noticed right away. If you take a close look at these stamens, they're basically solid yellow stalks. And you can see that clearly here. Although the bees are scared off. There's one. The pistols look identical, but the stamens do look different. Still a very pretty flower. All right, I'm back here at the flying saucer. I want to zoom in on these stamens. Make sure it's set up. Zoom in. Sun's peeking through. What's happen what happens if I block the light? Better? 
Maybe better. Definitely a buzz. Get some flying saucer, guys. Join the party. Okay, this is a little bonus footage here for you. This is a trichosirius with some cresting and some flowers. Let's look at that. It's a hybrid. Very interesting. These flowers are a nice reddish pink purple kind of glint on the edge there let's see if we can see that this is a cloudy day this is how they look on the cloudy day without a lot of shadows don't see any bees right now. How about a look at this crest here. Nice little crested arm on the side. Interesting plan. All right, more bonus footage. Let's get in here and see the yellow. Okay, how about a look down the tube? You want to look down the tube? There we go. Here's more bonus footage. Pinkness. What wonderful colors can we see on a cloudy day? Let's go in for a close up. Okay, this is a nice flying saucer here with some flowers on it, but you guys have already seen the flowers that look like this. Okay, now take a look at these buds here. This is how they look, and they're just starting to open. Okay, here's your super close-up of the hairy flower buds. Okay, I couldn't find any bees, but I found something else. Looks like a very small fly or a beetle, I can't really tell. Alright, good. We can end the video with a bee shot.
go down. How's it taste? Pretty good? Okay. There you go. Flying saucer cactus. Right, we got another long nose snake. Yeah, another long nose snake. It's a pretty dark one. Okay, not now very it. much red in his midsection. Let me zoom in on the head. Try to get those red eyes. Can't really see the eyes from this angle. It's yeah. dark. It's a really calm snake. Doesn't seem to mind being held. Camera shy, huh? Bye bye.